welcome back to Yoshi's Undertale Adventure, episode 9. Today, we will be going down here and seeing what's up. Oh. Boop. Oh, turns it. Turn every X into an O, and then press the switch. Oh, okay. Seems easy. Boom. Boom. What? How do you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? I left it. Really? Why we? You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta just so you could share it with me? Um, sure. Right now, human, I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> yeah. I'm also eating while doing this, so. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah. I don't know. Human. Hmm, how do I say this? You're taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. But fortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose, I suppose what I'm saying is, we're not human. I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try and solve the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to get the answer away. Okay. So I bet you gotta turn, yeah, same thing. Hmm. Maybe if I go. Okay, I think I know what I have to do. Okay, so yeah, okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm going to go all the way around. And. Oh man, it has to. Uh... Mm hmm. I need a hint, Papyrus. So, you want a hint, huh? Well, I've been looking at the puzzle, and I think the solution is to turn all the X's into O's. You should try it. Ask again for more great hints. Give me an extra hint. Maybe solving the last puzzle again will help. Ask again for more great hints. Eureka! I figured it out. The puzzle. It seems like you're having fun, though. Do you absolutely, absolutely want the solution? Do you absolutely, absolutely want the answer? The the solution is. Please imagine a drummer in your head. That switch, that tree over there has a switch on it. Check it out. This one. There's a switch in the trunk of this tree. Press it. Yes. You're did the. You lied. Oh, he didn't lie. You solved it. My advice helped. It really helped you. Incredible. I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh, Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. It's the human. You're going to love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each tile has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. 
They will let you you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Or blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to, to a tile, yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will need to slide. You will slide next to the next tile. However, slippery so smells like lemons. But to promise, you know, like purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Understand the explanation? Of course I do. But I don't. Great. Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. Yeah, hey, hey, hey. Get ready. Oh, God. Oh, God. And, uh, uh, um, papyrus. <laughs> Just walk away slowly. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking, lessons, he's improved a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. How mean. A safe point. Knowing that dog will never get up trying to make the perfect snow dog. It fills you with determination. Derp. I fell. Oh, now I have to do. The oh, wait, hold on. Let me try to do. I think I see the way. I know the way. Oh yeah. What's up? Nothing, Sands. What's up with you? How did? Ah. Huh. Gift trot confronts you. Gift trot. Sixteen attack. Six. Eight defense. Some teams decorated it as a prank. Leave me alone. Gift trap just trusts your youthful demeanor. Is this funny to you? Not really. You do look like some... You do look like... Christmas, combined with, like, Rudolph, combined with death. Uh, so let's, here, let's undecorate. You remove a small, confused dog. That's a little better. Okay, so blue, 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 blue. Okay. Ow. Ah, uh, come on. What the? What the what? Gift trot's antlers tremble. Okay, he died. 35 XP. I remember the days when I wasn't a genocidal maniac. Well, not really genocidal. Genocidal is when you kill everything. I think that's what genocidal means. Genocidal means like you killed a lot of things. I mean, I've only killed three people. So I guess I'm fine. I'm not a genocidal maniac. I am 
a killer. Say, are you following me? No, no, I'm not. I don't know what you're talking about. No, hmm, no, hmm, not, no, uh uh, no, I'm not doing it. No, mm -mm, no, I don't, no. Is it Snowball? Cool, Snowball. That's the end of the episode. Goodbye.